to the to the to the website and load the page and show into the view. So what we do here is this one. So so remember, uh, I have this search button. In the search button, what I do here in on click method, if you press the search button, which is button one, and what you do simply is just say this second line. So one, two, three, four, four line, you have your web view working. So whatever now you pass into this uh, load URL, whatever comes in HTML will be shown into the web view. Okay, so let's try to run it. I'll keep my finger crossed here. I didn't do anything. Okay, this is the emulator. Okay. So it will go, download, package the application, download the application, and then show you the application. So if you see here, I search for Java. It goes to the easydr.com. Uh, seems like my server is not working, but pretty much if you see that, this is what you are getting at the HTML. This is the HTML which you would have got when you would have typed this URL into, the, into your browser. So basically, this is what all you have. So the triple advisor, if you need to do that, you just need to get go to their website or ask them the HTML content, you get it, and you start putting in. We have time. Uh, I think I'll wrap up. I'll not show you further demo, uh, but quickly, again, the, about the preference, it's pretty easy to set the preference. You know, one line, and you are all set for, for uh, putting the preference for your application. You simply make this XML file. Uh, which is right here, this XML file. And again, you don't even need to write this XML. You simply go here, right click, new, and you have an Android XML file. And when you write XML file, write XML file, Android is, this Eclipse plugin is so generous, it'll ask you even what file you and it'll make a perfect kind of file for you. So basically, if you go to there, you go there, and it'll show you nice GUI to add more screen, right now I have two, email and password. This preference I'm setting up in my application to put the email and password so that I can get you the personalized information for you rather than in general information. So what I did, I simply add, I made the XML and I started adding the different kind of element I need. I need edit box for someone to put a username or password or list some of the stuff, all those things are available, uh, pretty easy. And that's it. That's that's you do, and and now I would show you the real cool stuff, which I I got excited when I was first time able to access my phone to to the the Linux, and I can do the ls command on my Linux. <laughs> <laughs> the kind of very hard on the Android phone. So if you could know that pain, uh, sorry, uh, from the BlackBerry phone, if you know that pain in the BlackBerry, you would really appreciate what I'm going to show you right now. All right. Uh, so let us go. Uh, I'm running out of time. Uh, CMD. So the Android uh, uh, SDK comes with something called Android Debugger Bridge Manager, and this is what will help you to to get into the Android phone. That's it. You are in the Android phone, okay? And I'll show you that. I'll connect my phone in a moment, and I'll show you I'll get into my real phone, which is logged. And you cannot do pretty much anything in that except doing a little bit LS here and there. That's where somebody was asking the question that what is the benefit of, of uh, ha uh, ro root, routing a phone, right? Routing a phone, for those who don't know, is meaning the getting the root access on the Linux operating system. That means routing the phone. So, uh, so the, the benefit of rooting the phone here is you know absolutely what's happening inside your phone while you are doing the application development. Otherwise, you have no clue what's happening inside. I'll show you in a moment that when we set the preference, what happens in, in the back end. Uh, so I go to, so basically, I'm not going to explain this because it takes a long time, but I'll go simply the place called data, sorry, CD. Data, CD, data. This is where I am right now. 
Okay, this is all the application which is running in my phone. This is all the application. And you know what? You can do this. How many of you like top? <laughs> so you have top. So you can do top. And the interesting part I showed you, I, I told you that you see this app 15, all that? You know what they are? The user. But nothing but assigned by the by the Android operating system to those applications. They're absolutely running in a different running as a different user. So no chance of this guy cheating that guy and get hanging into the other's processes, right? They're separate users. Unless until they're explicitly told by content provider or intent to access each other. Okay? What you have to do in order to do your phone? What you need to do to uh, do? Rooting. What you need? The question is, what you need to do in terms of rooting your phone? You go to Craigslist and say that Android rooting, and in twenty dollar you can pay and you can root your phone. <laughs> but 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 the, the, to answer specifically is a process. I have not done this because my insurance is still valid on that. I'm going to do this on on this fifth after I get my new phone. So, uh, so don't do that unless until uh, you really need it for development. I understand that you need it for development, but you will lose your warranty, which comes from the service uh, provider. So you better be careful, one part. And second part of not rooting, uh, having a non-rooted phone, you know what? Any of your user, or as 99% of users, not going to have the rooted phone. So you should, ex you know, tell, better you test your application on non-rooted phone rather than a rooted phone where you have all the access, you know. So it's, it's always good. So uh, this, uh, in, in, if you search on the internet, uh, Google saying that uh, rooting Android phone, there's a couple of websites which gives you step-by-step -step instruction on how you can break that, uh, you know, license and, and get into the root. Uh, or you just buy an access. Um, yes, there's another yeah another six hundred dollar investment. You can if you want to do that, you know buy. I hear that they stop selling it directly. I'm sorry. True. I'm sorry. I remember that the Google stopped selling directly to users. Uh, the Google phone. Nexus phone. My partner bought it, so I don't know now. Maybe uh, somebody would. Can. Nexus S. Nexus S. Are they selling? Uh, oh, oh, oh. I don't think they're selling officially anymore, but there's. Oh, Nexus One is, is is old now. Yeah, obviously they have Nexus, but 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 is this open? Yeah, you you can get the development. Yeah, nah, yeah, but you don't get a sprint on that. I have a sprint. Yeah, you get to go to the T-Mobile. You know, you don't get four. You get four now on T-Mobile, which is AT and T now. So so anyway. <laughs> All right. Uh, so uh, let's get into the little cool stuff. Let's see that what's happening when I'm setting the preference. Very quick. Jim is looking at me and saying that here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, so. I'll go into the, the process and the, the area of what we have just developed, okay? And let's see that what happens behind the scene. Okay, PWD, okay, CD, data, CD, data, <coughs> LS, and CD, if uh, you want to com, easy dia, misspelled on right, uh, com dot, easy dia dot a, N D R O D. Okay, so this is what I have. This is my data of related to my specific application. You see, there are different directory for the data. I do PWD for every application. You have a separate from there. I would not be seeing. And uh, I, believe me, I did not make this font so small deliberately. Property, okay, is good. Better, much better. All right. Can you see that? Okay. PWD. Okay, so you are in that data space. What you see here is a, a cache a database and a lib. Okay, now I'm going to go back to the application which I showed you. And uh, where is the application? Uh, hold on, hold. Hold on, what? Hold. Okay. You hold it down. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, 